all to one power one. Welcome. Um, today I'll be teaching how to make an unbreakable wall. Um, so the same concept can be applied to make a building. So you basically make the wall on all four sides. So um, so as you can see, when you break something, it the um, broken space automatically fills up. So um, you practically can't get through. So let's make it. Okay, so to build this, you're gonna need uh, redstone repeaters, redstone dust, um, pistons, buttons, water buckets, lava buckets, uh, cobblestone, any block of your choice, and a chest or a furnace. So first, what you're gonna do is decide where and how long you want your wall to be. See, I wanted five blocks for now, so you're gonna do one, two, three, four, five, and you're gonna place your chest or furnace here. Placing this chest is because when the pistons start pushing cobblestone you don't want it to go past this so as pistons can't push chest you're gonna uh, place a chest right there next you're gonna fill your hole with pistons facing upward and you're gonna dig um, two back so uh, three back sorry you're gonna dig three blocks back um you're gonna place repeaters everywhere uh, touching the pistons mind you the repeaters should be facing the piston not away from them um you're gonna put them all on Three delay, and you're gonna do the same thing with the row. You're gonna do the same thing with the row behind. So all of them on three delay. Uh, next, you're gonna take your redstone, and you're gonna connect all these repeaters together, and you're gonna take this out. Uh, next, you're gonna build a cobblestone generator. So basically, how this works is the cobblestone uh, gets generated by the cobblestone generator and it keeps getting pushed onto these pistons which push it upwards so what you're gonna do next is you're gonna place a cobblestone block over here and you're gonna build three to this side and one two here so make that little ring um, next you're gonna uh, sorry you're gonna put the cobblestone here uh, next you're going to build this side up the one block side up by one block and um, your lava is going to be uh, I mean your cobblestone is going to be forming here so what you're going to do is you're going to take your piston facing toward your wall you're going to place that uh, piston over there and then you're going to replace that bit of cobblestone um, then you're gonna take your water bucket and you're gonna place it right here so the water flows towards the cobblestone and you're gonna take um, lava I, sorry you're gonna uh, break this off for now and break that cobblestone and you're gonna put take your lava and you're gonna do that over there so now as you can see cobblestone has formed over there so I mean sorry stone has formed over there what you're gonna do next is break that stone. Until the cobblestone forms from this side. And you're done for the cobblestone generator. Now every time you break this bit of cobblestone, a new a new cobblestone will form over there. So uh, next you're gonna build a redstone clock. So you're gonna build this one um, to you're gonna build a tire to uh, redstone block, uh, redstone block, sorry. So you're gonna place two repeaters side by side in a square formation. All on tier, uh, this th all on the third delay, and you're gonna connect them with like this. You're gonna take this side to the head, and you're gonna place a button over there. Next, you are going to take uh, the pistons and connect it to these. And you're going to take your piston, the cobblestone generator piston, and connect it to the same clock. On this side, you will place two repeaters one on three delay and one on two. Uh, sorry, two on three delay and one on two. No, wait, one second. Yes, two and uh, three delay and one and two, and you're done. So you're gonna hit this button right here, and as you can see, cobblestone will get pushed out. Break this block right here. Cobblestone will continually get pushed out onto those pistons.
Okay, sorry. What you're gonna do is you're gonna break this one right here, and you're gonna connect it separately. And this side, you're gonna connect it with this side of the repeater. So what this essentially does is separates the two's timing, and now it's gonna work the way you want. So as you can see, it's building the uh, this it's building the wall, and just leave this for a while, and automatically build the wall completely. And after that's done, when you break any block that you uh, any block on the wall, it'll automatically reform. As you can see, it's now done. And when you go over and you break any block in the wall, it'll automatically fix it back. So um, you can you can't get through the wall essentially.